Hey everyone, Scott here to discuss Elf, starring Will Furel, James Caan, Zoe Deschanel, Ed Asner, Mary Steenenbergen, Bob Newhart, Daniel Tay, Faison Love, Peter Dinklage, and Amy Serdis, Serdis or something like that, and directed by John Favreau. And as for Amy, I'm sorry about that. Please forgive me. So I remember going to see this in theaters, and I had a fun time with it, and it was a good time too. So let's see how good it is compared to today. Let's get into it. It tells the story of one, of one Christmas Eve night, whereas a baby buddy goes on to Santa Claus Santa's Christmas bag away from the orphanage, and every elf plus Santa is shocked, and Buddy is, lives at the North Pole until as an adult, played by Wolf Feral. And how do they? And how do the reindeer fly? From the Christmas spirit. Wolf Feral is very charming and funny. Or actually the machine runs by Christmas spirit. Wolf Feral is very f charming and funny in this movie. And his character I related with. I mean come on. Who can't relate with him as a character? He's very relatable. The special effects are good here. As well as in, the begin in this beginning. But he finds out he's not really an elf. He's a human. And his father doesn't know he exists. And his father Walter Hobbs. Played by James Conn. As Buddy travels to his father's home in New York City, and as he and as he travels there, he gets attacked by a raccoon at the forest, and he arrives in New York City and gets his elf shenanigans done, and goes to the Empire State Building to visit his father while work while at work. And I like James Conn's character Walter. I think he's interesting, even though he's really on the naughty list. Buddy goes to a working mall and enters a Christmas store, and Faison Love gets Buddy to work and meets Joby, played by Zoe Deschanel, and works on the st store after he hears Santa is coming to town, and the way Will Ferrell screams, Santa! Oh my god! I know him! I know him! is a classic for this movie, and that's, why, and that's what makes this movie uh, the holiday classic it is today. Buddy hears Jovi sing in the shower, and she talks to him about it, thinking he's some kind of pervert, I'll say, and stops a man who's not Santa Claus, he, and trash talks him, and yanks his beard off, and with which cracks me up to this day, and I love how good this, of a person he is by complimenting her singing, and Zoe Deschanel is very good in this movie as a singing human, and elf as Buddy thinks she is. Buddy is in jail and Walter bails him out and takes him to the doctor who's played by the director John Favreau and who helps who helps one Walter whether or not Buddy is his son and I love the scene just the way Will Ferrell screams ow it's just so funny Walter, after the doctor, introduces Buddy, his wife, Emily, played by Mary Steenenbergen, and son Michael, has, as they have dinner as a family with Buddy for the first time, and I love that scene because of how weird he is during that scene, and he, it just cracks me up. I love Will Ferrell. I don't know what to tell you. Buddy picks up Michael from school, and they get attacked by snowballers, and Buddy makes a ton of small snowballs, and takes them down, and Michael accepts him, and Buddy asks Jovi on a date, and I'm having fun in this movie. Walter takes Buddy to work and puts him in the mail room to work, and he has fun there. As and all of this, that is very funny. Meanwhile, Walter tries to bring Buddy in Miles Finch, played by Peter Dinklage, who's a total jerk in this movie, but I enjoy his presence in this movie. Buddy and Jovi go out on a date, and they have such a great chemistry together. Meanwhile, Buddy calls Miles an elf, doesn't take it wrong at first, until eventually he calls him an angry elf, and beats him up, and Walter throws him out of his life, and Michael goes out and tries to find him on a Christmas Eve, and Buddy commits suicide almost, until he sees Santa, played by Ed Asner. M and Michael, Walter, and Jovi sing Christmas songs to bring back the Christmas spirit to everybody in New York on Santa's sleigh. That's ran by Christmas spirit, like I just said. 
and it works as Buddy and Jovi begin dating, and the very end is ending. And this ending is very sweet, and Buddy becomes half human, half slash half elf, and that's why this is a classic holiday movie it is today. Now it's time for the rating. I'll give this movie a 8.5 out of 10. This is the holiday classic we need from 2003 to today. I really enjoy the lovable character Wolf Ferrell is in this movie, and Zoe Deschanel is great in this movie. The movie is very funny, and as for the director, John Favreau, he pulled off the effects very well before Zathura in Iron Man. So I'd like to thank you guys for joining me for Elf, and I want to wish you guys a Merry Christmas and Happy New Year, and until next time, Sarah!